the remainder operator looks like a percentage sign and it gives the remainder of the division of two numbers. So for instance, want to find out the remainder of, let's say, 14 divided by 3. So we will say remainder equals 14, then the percentage sign and then the number we want to divide with. So if I say 3 and if I now say console.log and click on run, we see 2. So why is this? Why do we see here a 2? Let me explain this to you. So imagine this. So for this, let's go back to basic high school math. We say here 14 percentage sign 3. What we do he here is imagine we have, let's say, 14 apples. So I'm gonna draw this as apples. Just pretend that these lines here are apples, okay? So we have 10 and now we have 4. So 5, 5, 4, it's 14. With the percentage sign, we want to find the remainder of the division between 14 and 3. So now what we do? We know that 3 times 4 equals 12, alright? And now if we would add another 3, so for example 3 times 5, we would have 15. But 15 is higher as 14, so we can't use that, okay? So we can't use 15. So our the number, which is the closest one to 14, it's in our case 12. So now we have 14, so we do 14 minus 12. And the subtraction of these two numbers is 2. So that's the reason why we have 2 here showing up in the console. If I run this again, we see here 2. Okay, for example, if we would do this with 15, we would have in the console 0. Why? Because there is no reminder left. So if I click on run, we see 0. Because 15 divided by 3 is actually 5, but like I said, we don't get our reminder back like we do when we, for example, have here 14. Or let's even say 16. So for, for 16 and the percentage sign 3, we will have a reminder of 1. Why? Because the closest one we can get is 15. Why is that so? So let's say we have 3, then we can go to 6, then we can go to 9, then we can go to 12, then we can go to 15, then to 18. But we see, like I said again, we have here 16. So we can't use numbers that are bigger than 16. So 18 it's out. What's left is 15. So 60 divided by 3 and we wanna find the remainder is 15. But it's actually not 15 but you get you, you get the point. We can divide 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 times and what we get left is 1, which is here in the console. The remainder operator is often used to determine if a number is even or odd. If you can divide a number by 2 and the remainder is 0, that means the number is even. If you can't, then it means it's not even. So this was about finding a remainder and I'm gonna see you in the next lecture.